Batteries of tomorrow could be developed at the Rochester Institute of Technology. The university opened a new battery prototyping lab today, and Jeff Rusnak says this lab could be used to tackle some global issues. Rachel, this lab could fix simple things like making your cell phone battery last twice as long. It could also make electric cars more practical for the everyday driver. This was the site at RIT this morning as scientists, politicians, and business owners celebrated the opening of the Battery Prototyping Laboratory. The idea of this lab is to share it with researchers at the university and with companies throughout western New York. The lab is designed to be similar to to a manufacturing plant so companies working on new batteries will be able to tell if their designs could be mass produced. If we can help them commercialize their product and take it to the next level, uh, then that's you know, the ultimate goal of this facility. Instead of doing it at the lab scale, you have automated equipment that can really replicate the commercial scale. The directors of the lab say RIT has already made a cell phone battery that lasts twice as long. It's just a matter of mass producing the prototype, something the lab could make much easier. Very interesting. We can all use some longer lasting batteries. Absolutely. Right?